starting a new one. Um, where's the, where's the can opener? Here it is. Gonna dump this out here in the green cart. <coughs> in a bag in the green cart. Outdated can of evaporated milk and an outdated can of mackerel packed in China. This is instead of me going for a walk. Yeah. This one says 2020, so. I'll get rid of that. This one's a year outdated. This one is something 21, so that's all right. Oh, you couldn't see me over there. Can of evaporated milk and can of uh, cranberry jelly. What a mess. I need a spoon. Well, a fork will do. Uh, would how long will your preserves last if they're under pressure pressure and in a dark cooler spot they say uh, 2012 on them so I don't know I don't know. Uh, one thing about this here oven here. Google says most shelf stable foods are safe indefinitely. In fact, canned goods will last for years. Is every time I use it under pressure, it gathers up a lot of water in there. And it has to be dried out really good. There's a crack in the table, the water comes down on under here, so I got a pot down here to catch the water. And since I don't want to waste all these every time I dry them and reuse them, they're bounty. Woohoo! I smell sauerkraut. Because that's what I cooked last. Uh, 
because that bit of drip tray does not catch the water like it's supposed to. That's done. Now, just wiping the top of the garbage can off here. It's black, so you can see dust. What else was I going to do? It's only 10.51. Yeah, you preppers. How long will you keep your can you food you processed yourself and canned yourself. I'll just come out and walk around I guess. It's gonna be a nice day. Another one of these cans laying around. one thing I don't miss is cans laying everywhere and Richard's company. Oh for heaven's sake, so there's the phone again. going to pick tomatoes. I hear the chickadees. Start a new clear bag. Clean plastic, clean jars, clean cans, more plastic, more cans, plastic cans, bottles, cans, cans, plastic, plastic. was around my computer. I suppose I should say that. Just in case. Might as well put these in for the year. 
my pink sandals. And these ones too. I only wore these once or twice. Put my sneakers inside where it's warm. Warmer. Garbage, garbage. More garbage, garbage. And a plastic bag. Not often you find a plastic bag, but got a hole, so. It goes in with the blue bag. I can't do this kind of thing when it's hot. No, I have to wait until. Wait until, yeah, this is what we bought. Easy to grow at the dollar store. Many. Got a lot of them. And the beef steak. I can't see a, a price, but save these for tell us what to get next year. <laughs> the way we forget things. I can't get that out of there, so I'm just going to have to transfer it from one to the other. From one blue garbage bag to another. This can go in the green cart. It doesn't have to take up room in the recycle. I'll just transfer in more over. beet jars. More beet jars. <laughs> Grape container. Cans. Ugh. It's not garbage week, but I like to have it done and down there, so when at least I feel like doing something today. The, the Wednesday night before garbage, I might not feel up to it, so. Because I do have a lot of downtime because of my insomnia. Yeah, so this is empty. There's just a few little crumbs down there in the bottom. I forget what I did with the garbage this last winter. Yeah, what did I... Did I have them out here or in the little room? 
There's a lot of stuff in the little room. I got a lot of bags of stuff I crocheted up and yarn. I just got fed up. What's the sense of crocheting up more stuff if I can't sell or give away what I got? Already made. Yeah. Anyway, let's... This is when it's snow. It's winter. Right, can I get in there? Well, this is Christmas. Oh, if I don't get a shed, some place to put stuff. We were going to go to Bridgewater, but there's rumors there's a case of, been a case of, uh, so, I don't know. Richard's vaxxed, I'm not. Doesn't matter if you got the vaccination or not, you can still carry it, you can still get it, you can still die from it. So, what's the big deal about getting it? It's not just because I don't want to, like a lot of people just don't want to. But I guess they got their reasons too. My reason is I'm already chemically sensitive and... Uh, severely allergic to proteins and stuff that's in in the thing the way i understand it it's got proteins in it and the proteins latch on inside your body maybe to your own proteins i don't know i and then they they keep multiplying but if i take that i will be sick the rest of my life so i gotta just take my chances on not getting it the virus i mean I guess I can fit a few more cans in there, <laughs> or bottles, whatever, until, well, it's a week from tomorrow, a week from today, garbage day, so, yeah. Oh, these here paper bags. Paper bags for the, I don't know what these boxes are, what came in these boxes? This here is for Richard's bike. Another thing for bikes. I'll hang it up there with all the other things that got cobwebs on them. Put boxes inside a box, it looks like. My name, I got my name blotted out, so that's all right. I don't know, Richard will uh, burn these or break them down. Yeah, I don't need all these boxes here. I keep them in case I have to send things back. They want you to send it back in the same uh, box you got it in. So, anyway, I'll let him take those. <laughs> See what he's going to do with them. Uh, is that enough digging around in this porch? Yeah. Here's my old computer bag that one of my daughters borrowed it, and it was getting old. It's 
she had borrowed it for a long time and it just got unusable I guess so she brought it back to me this here bag is going to smell forever I know it is because it's the material not anything that's just on the outside of the bag it's the material itself that's my life okay those boxes are going to rich I'm going to take my sneakers and my sandals in, put them in that, well, not now. When I go back in, I'm going to put them over there in that, in that cavern over there where I put my footwear. Oh, I got a bag of garbage, yeah. Walk that down to the garbage, yes. Yeah, might as well. I'm waiting for lunch time, so I fill in doing stuff. Ah. Leaves are starting to turn in here. Yellow. Red up there across the road. Yellow here. There's the blackberry bush, I think, that pretty reddish brown one. There's one over here, maple tree. big spider the last time I was here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, just remembering it now. This is heavy. This cover is heavy. Ah! But I got it in. And no big spider got me. <laughs> okay, so we're just here. See all the pretty colors down the road? And across the road. Yeah. What's that old helmet doing in there? That I was up to put in the garbage. I can't see it blowing down there as heavy as it is. Pine trees are turning yellow, some of them. Just picking up a couple pieces of garbage there by the entrance of the Richie's parents' home. Oh, look at this. 
Maximum what? I don't know what that come up on the screen. Maximum something doesn't give you time to read it. Okay, right here I can smell the apples from the apple tree. There was just so much beauty all around me. Just gorgeous around the edges here. Look at all the rose hips. Pick up another piece of garbage. Just a blaze of color they got to look at, or they always had to. Mom's in a place now where she's got trees. She look out her window and she's got trees, so she'll see some colors. Leaves falling, wildlife coming out. And where Dad is in heaven, he can see everything everywhere. Everything's way more beautiful than ever. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's got a couple more things to do before we can get started on doing stuff around the yard. Where am I going to put this garbage? I might as well just carry it home with me. Oh. <laughs> growl, growl, growl. Growl, growl, growl. Oh. Okay, I see what it is now. What a beautiful day, huh? I love the clouds, so this is nice too. Big fluffy clouds I like. See what time it is. Eleven eighteen. Let's get home. Get my brunch ready. I haven't eaten since six. Well, it was going on for six last night. So <clears throat> Oh, what do we got over here now? Some more nature. Another piece of garbage. Hey. We got some dandelions, clover, aster, Queen Anne's lace, and what are the other ones? Golden rods. <laughs> Took me a while to remember that. Yeah. Okie dokie, here we go. Up the hill. <laughs> Little tiny maple tree. <laughs> okay. Oh, my leg just started to... The right leg for that. I don't know if it's sciatica or not. Because every time I... Go down there to the... There's the well there. There's a tiny little... Berries. Oh yeah, every time I lay on my either side, 
mostly my right leg hurts, but sometimes my left. And as soon as I lay over on my back, it goes away. Now, I know some of you are nurses or retired nurses, or maybe you have the answer. What a mess. Oh, I can't even look at it. Ah, oh, look in the window. My beautiful girl. I don't know if you can see her or not. Oh, oh I still didn't pick. There's some mosquitoes. Yeah, the mosquitoes are... Get him. It's only mommy. Mama. The next one is me picking tomatoes, but it's too long to add here. So I'll do it tomorrow, Lord willing. Good night.